your first alert forecast with Chief Meteorologist Chad Crilly. So definitely a rainy first half of the day today with scattered to numerous showers and thunderstorms, even a couple of stronger updrafts out there. All that rain has concluded this evening. We are partly cloudy and there is a cold front. It is positioned to our north now working through central Alabama behind the front. There's a lot less moisture in the air, so drier conditions are on the way. You'll feel it tomorrow. It's not going to feel quite as tropical outside. However, with less moisture in the air, temperatures will be able to climb further as we head into the weekend, so it is going to be hot. Air temperatures look to run from about 93 to 96 degrees, feeling more like the upper 90s, close to 100 degrees, particularly on Sunday. So we'll enjoy the dry air while we have it. Conditions comfortable to our north. Look at the dew points, upper 40s in Kansas City, same with Minneapolis. This drier air continues to spill into our region. It'll be here in no time. For now, temperatures are still in the mid 80s. It is 85 degrees in Dothan, 87 in Ozark. Notice how we are a couple of degrees cooler than where we would normally be this time of the evening. That's because of the rain earlier on. 87 in Geneva. Florala also checking in here in the upper 80s for us. We'll take you through your evening planner. If you're heading out for a late dinner tonight, temperatures fall back into the mid 70s by around 10 o'clock. After midnight, we'll be in the low 70s, and we start tomorrow morning off partly cloudy at about 72 degrees for us. I want to walk you through this weekend because there are a couple of things that we're tracking the heat and then the return of some moisture and thunderstorms. So Friday at 7 a.m. that cold front will continue to be pushing through our region just because the front comes through doesn't mean we're not going to warm up. As I explained earlier, it is looking like a hot weekend. Friday will have temperatures that are going to be climbing into the mid 90s for us. On Saturday, briefly, our winds will turn out of the north as surface high pressure will be overhead. So temperatures may be a degree or two cooler. That same high pressure system moves over the Gulf as we head into Sunday. Our winds will change out of the south, so it is going to be hot also turning a little more humid. This is a day where the heat index could come close to 100 degrees. Beyond that, our eyes are on the tropics. It is looking like an unorganized area of low pressure of some sort may try to come together as we head into early next week. It is unlikely that this is going to develop into anything major. However, it is possible a lot of moisture could head in our direction from that system, so rain chances will be on the rise as well. We'll keep an eye on that. That is sort of a pattern that would bring us some heavier rain and maybe flooding concerns. That's still a ways off. For Friday, hot, 94 degrees. We're 92 on Saturday. Remember, a couple of degrees cooler. Mid-90s for Sunday, and then the moisture starts to return on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. With showers and thunderstorms, by the end of the week, we're starting to tap into that tropical moisture with thunderstorm chances continuing.